Well, some call it unfinished business in the Brady District, but the fate of the OK Pop Museum remains uncertain. Two News reporter Brandon Richards shows us where the project stands right now. Well, Dina, supporters of the OK Pop Museum already have the land they need and pledges of support totaling millions of dollars. Now the only thing standing in their way, state lawmakers. The Brady Arts District seen many changes in recent years. It's all been positive change. It's, it's been a great thing. But restaurant owner Jeff Castleberry says something's missing. I think the OK Pop Museum, I, it, it's, a, it's a feather in our hat if we were able to get that. The four-story museum would showcase Oklahoma's contribution to pop culture. Big names already on board. I, for one, will be their opening day. I can't wait to see this. But legislators must approve a $42 million bond issue. The Oklahoma Historical Society, which would manage the museum, says there's still strong support for it. And though lawmakers have yet to consider it this year, supporters remain hopeful. For the Brady District, it's just really the final uh, jewel in the crown. A crown that remains unfinished. And supporters expect state lawmakers to take up this issue in the next few weeks. We'll stay on top of it and let you know what happens. Live in Tulsa this morning, Brandon Richard, 2 News works for you.